Welcome to your corporate wellness update of the day. If we look at the investor statistics that's measuring index funds, we see that health and well-being is 3.7% of how funds look at bringing in companies in their index fund. If this is 3.7%, we would want to see that number in society, but also in our companies. So if we do a quick look at Australia, we see that there's 65,000 people walking in well-being in the country on a working population of 12 million. This accounts for 0.5% of the working population, which is not the same to the 3.7% that investors are looking at. So there's a shortage of 343,000 well-being managers in Australia. It's easy to have a look at your own company. If you're working in a company or if you want to become a well-being consultant, have a look around of all the companies. Are they having someone working in well-being? Someone working in health? Because if investors are looking at 3.7%, that means for every 100 employees, 3.7 of them would be working in health or well-being. Because numbers show reality. If you focus on it, it happens. Thanks for watching this daily meetup. If you want to join our team, book an application session via our website, consultants apply for a strategy session. And if you have any questions, email them to hello at moveit.eu. Talk to you soon. Bye.